it is sad to actually hear stories like this because stories like this actually get uh, momentum when it gets to the internet you see netizens crying out and nobody wants to experience another NSAS reloaded what do you think the police Nigerian police force should do to tackle extortion because it is beginning to uh, be in the news every other day one citizen complaining about police extortion molestation and all the interesting thing about this story is that we are hearing claims, meaning that this release is done by probably a lawyer. And we want to think that I want to think that um, the victim should immediately uh, do uh, a legal paper to uh, police. So we cannot rely on this because it's an accusation of Nigeria made against Nigerian police. So the Nigerian uh, police spokesperson, either at Lagos State. A command or even at the federal level should make a release. Oh. Let the lawyer follow up, right? Has he taken the has he pressed for charges, go to court? What is actually the situation right now? Because we cannot uh, begin to talk about if this if we hear so many stories about uh, uh, this uh, uh, this in this nature. Yeah. So let's see a situation where uh, the lawyers here will you know bring it to fore what actually transpired. Can they go to court? Can IG be reached? Well, we, we, what we, is the we, we right hope they, they will come up with something reasonable. You know, when I was talking with her, I was like, how sure we're there that these people uh, were actually policemen? But hearing zone two, it means that they actually went to police station. Yeah, and okay. though it's an, a, an, an allegation, but we hope they will come up with something positive.